Welcome to another episode of Stock List, the show where we take you through the various stocks on our personal watch list and advise you on whether you should be looking into them as well. Quick disclaimer, Michael. We're not financial analysts. Nope. Neither are we financial advisors. Nope. Take everything we say with a pinch of salt. Yep. Maggie. Yep. Flour. Anything. Everything else. Enjoy with it. <laughs> and like we always say. Yep. This is for entertainment purposes only. That's it. All right. So what stock are we looking into today? So today we're going to look into a stock that most of you single lot use. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> most of you bad youths. <laughs> You've downloaded every app under their portfolio. Yep. But you probably didn't know that it's owned by one person. It's owned by one person, yeah, one group, one group basically. Yeah. So we're looking into Match Group Inc. Yep. Match Group Inc. is a tech company, and they're headquartered in Dallas. Okay. Uh, they own Tinder. Yep. Match Match dot com. Yep. OK Cupid. I never heard of that one. Hinge yeah. and plenty of fish. So Bear Man's <laughs> farms right now are sore because you'd be swiping right so on all of these apps, love. not knowing that Match Group owns all, all of, them. of them. Yeah. So yeah, um, all, all, all your 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 money that you're paying to the Tinder to get extra swipes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Extra. Oh man. There you go. Certain so are paying that sixty dollars uh, yeah. uh, subscription fee Imagine for plenty of fish just to see girls here that, yeah, that you're gonna see in the ends you're gonna see in the ends anyway <laughs> 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 in the ends. anyway all right let's but, move on so uh, so yeah they they run over 45 dating companies bro, as I a didn't whole even know there was 45 dating yeah, companies yeah it's peak Ugh, it's nuts yeah man. and they generate r- revenue from subscriptions instead mm. of ads so more time when you're on these apps yeah mm. this is not know? my personal opinion like, yeah, personal like we, yeah, we don't know yeah we yeah, don't know yeah. i've never been on these apps yeah. ever <laughs> but yeah um, Walter, when you're on these apps, you never get ads uh, shown across the thing. Mm. That most likely put you off going on these, yeah, um, on these apps, apps anyway. anyway. Mm. So, so they, they, they just charge what the subscription? Yeah, subscription. So it's twenty dollars for one month. Yeah, sixty dollars for which, six on months. Which app? Oh, I don't know. We need to ask our friends. <laughs> <laughs> It's, it's, it's a bit sticky. I don't know. You know it's these numbers are too perfect. <laughs> <laughs> That's a problem. <laughs> well, well, ask some of the men them. Don't worry. Um, <laughs> All right, cool. So, so yeah, take us feel like the CEO and that. Yeah. So the CEO, she's mm-hmm. called Shah Doobie. You know, more time I butcher the name anyway. But yeah. so I apologize. <laughs> <Doobie>. for... <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Continue. <laughs> So tell us about the, the the this lady Shah Duby. Yeah. yeah, so Shah Duby, um, she's the only thing I really know about her. I know she's married because mm. she doesn't really put her information out there like that, innit? Okay. She got she got about two kids. She's married and she's from India. The reason I'm bringing up her um, ethnicity mm-hmm. is because, according to reports, um, the United States mm. takes the lead as the most active country for online dating, okay. followed by India. Wow. But we will know, yeah, that Asian markets, yeah, they, they jump on things yeah, yeah, quickly yeah, yeah, anyway. Yeah, 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 yeah. So yeah. the fact that she's from India, she knows how to um, help. Um, she, she already match understands group. the market. Yeah, she understands the market. market. She, she knows how to operate within, I'm assuming, mm. she knows how to operate um, within India so she can help Matchgroup grow within India and the Asian markets. Okay, okay. And okay. also in um, America too. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, those yeah. are two major uh, markets, innit? Yeah. A lot of you probably thinking, right, so if people are finding love in America and India, yeah. where's UK on the list? <laughs> UK ranks uh, fourth on the list. Wow. So it goes United States, yeah. India. Yeah. Ireland. Ireland, bro. <laughs> are there even enough people Them in that country? Them are really swiping. <laughs> hey, that's wild. UK and yeah. lastly, Spain as well. Okay, yeah. Come yeah, on, stand yeah. man. Yeah. Uh, I'm surprised yeah. France is not in this, but, you know. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's true, innit? Yeah. No, nah, but you see French, yeah, they got sauce, so they just moved to girls, like... Yeah, it's true, innit? Yeah, 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 Everyone Whereas else. The, the, the UK is more <laughs> these apps and that. Yeah, 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 it's true. It's true. Yeah, so Instagram and that. Exactly. All right. So, yeah, do you want to take us through... Um, the, the stock information. Yeah. All right, so right now, as we're recording, the current stock price from Match Group is 147 USD. Um, they are listed on the NASDAQ mm-hmm. as MTCH, if you're looking for them. Now, the IPO date was on the 19th of November, 2015. So they've been public for over five years Five now. years, yeah. Yeah, which to me isn't very surprising. It's not too surprising because it's it's a, it's a tech company. You know, yeah, tech companies yeah. started booming in the last, what, 10 yeah, years? yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? So it makes sense. And um, their 52 range has been between $44.69 and $148.10. Yeah. So right now, they're trading at the highest price they've been for a whole year. Mm-hmm. It's winter season. You know, even when oh, people yeah. weren't using um, dating apps here, people go on like, let's say, Instagram or whatnot yeah, yeah, yeah. to find 
like a buddy, isn't it? A cozy, <laughs> a cozy friend. <laughs> Let me call it's it like a cozy coffee friend. season. <laughs> coffee season, isn't it? Yeah, that's, that's the realness. It's so, true. Yeah, that's that's it's why true. it's booming at the moment, isn't it? Mm. Yeah, it's, it's cold out in the streets. No, it's, that's the realness, yeah, it's boy. Cold. It's cold in these streets. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but the fifty-two week range is interesting compared to the actual current stock price because one hundred and forty-seven dollars is very close to the high of one hundred and forty-eight. Yeah, yeah. So it's like it's, to me, if I buy now, I'm, it's not likely. It's apparently, go. we're going to, uh, um, uh, to a third lockdown. That's why it's almost peaking right now because yeah, yeah. everyone is preparing themselves for a third lock- mm, lockdown. Downloaded indoors. these apps, getting ready, innit? Yeah, 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 yeah. That's yeah. the truth. Wow. Remember at the at their fifty-two um, week, range. week range, the yeah. highest. Yeah. That was probably early earlier in the pandemic. Mm. I don't know when about it's in the pandemic, yeah, mm. but that was probably earlier on, yeah, when we were just about to come off it. Mm, that's when they reached their peak the peak okay yeah but now we're obviously we're going to another pandemic um, uh, another lockdown another lockdown yeah it might yeah. go up again yeah okay well, well we'll go through the revenue and the actual financials now yeah yeah so in 2019 mm-hmm. they they brought in as in revenue they brought in two over two billion dollars okay yeah so 2.05 billion mm-hmm. that's a that's a, a staggering staggering figure mm. yeah versus what they've already brought in in the first three months, uh, sorry, the first three quarters of yep. this year, which is 1.7 billion. So, yep. so they're, they're, they're almost touching the, yeah. the 2 billion number. On track to in. meet yeah. the revenue figures of from last year. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Now, profitability, however, mm-hmm. they've smashed it. Mm. So, last year, they brought in 431 million in net profit. Mm. This year, in the first three quarters, they've already smashed that at 530 million. Do you get it? So they made down, peace this year. Down to the subscriptions, subscriptions and the costs yeah. as well. They don't really advertise. More time is word mm, of mouth. Mm, mm, mm. So when they're cutting down their revenue, mm. um, their costs is they're not really um, they don't really have like advertising costs to take out of their revenue. Mm. To, so that's why their profits are high. Yeah, higher, yeah. And also the revenue, um, the reason why is like that as well. So like we said, people are paying for paid subscriptions. Certain men don't want to just yeah. limit themselves to five. Yeah, five uh, swipes. Five, five swipes, <laughs> isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> they want more yeah but they want I, more I feel like also because people are at home now yeah mm. you can't go out and move to girls you have mm. to move to girls from the comfort of your house because yeah, you're locked yeah. in this is what's benefiting match group especially yeah. as they're the monopoly in the market like they mm. they own most of these things isn't it? so if you're not downloading hinge you're mm. gonna download puff if you're not downloading uh, puff you're, you're gonna download uh, match Ma- you're, yeah, yeah, there's, yeah there's always something there's always that something. they own that yeah, you're gonna yeah, likely yeah. download yeah. they yeah. got competitors like uh, bumble and, and um, harmony e harmony and harmony and that but that's more for serious dating and that yeah yeah so, so this yeah is, well, it's for the joke man <laughs> <laughs> he said that's for serious status <laughs> so yeah that's why with, with their profitability it's mm. going up because people are subscribing to the, um, the app because it's a tried and tested mm. like match group apps are tried and tested yeah 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 people love it people love it yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right cool yeah. now one thing that's strange yeah mm. is the eps figure so the mm. earnings per share yeah um in t- in in 2019 mm-hmm. it was a 4.5 dollars mm-hmm. per share right this year it's gone down to 0.46 so it's mm. gone down by over 80 yeah, percent. yeah do you understand and that's a massive decline in the earnings per share. Yeah. So for me, I don't know. I feel like because the the earnings per share has gone down so much. Mm-hmm. Um, I don't know. I feel like people may not want to purchase the stock. Like yeah. it may not be as attractive as it mm-hmm. was last year. Definitely. You understand? Having having said that though, the 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 price is is yeah it's as high as it's, it is. Yeah, yeah, exactly. On average, so I don't know. It's a strange one. Um, the free cash flow. Mm-hmm. 2019 was 801 million. Um, in 2020, it's 800 million on the dot. So far, we still have one more quarter to report. So mm. we'll see. Well, obviously, that number's going to go up. Yeah. Do you understand? So that means to me, they have a lot of to 800 million in, in free yeah. cash flows, a lot yeah. compared to anybody. We'll be interested to see what, what we'll they talk do about with that their money. growth strategy yeah. later, but we'll yeah. be interested to actually see what they do with their cash flow, innit? Because mm. you can't just have the cash just chilling in the bank. Use it to like, improve Invest the business, innit? Yeah, yeah, of course. So yeah, of course. Anyway, we'll, we'll, we'll find out the pros and cons. Yeah, so so do you want to take us through a couple of the pros? Yeah, so one of the pros, you yeah, know, reason why mm. uh, the online dating industry um, is gonna it's gonna blow. It's gonna blow. It's, <laughs> just, <laughs> it's because the perception of online dating has changed here yeah, over the past, I say, ten to twelve years. Yeah. So back in the day, you used to think old guy on a laptop yeah, trying to look for his, his yeah, babes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 It's true. True. I think that's where the whole term sugar daddy came from. Wow. More time, yeah. it was old guy behind the computer uh, yeah, and trying to trying move to, to younger it. things and yeah, trying yeah. to finesse wow. but um when now people are moving well apps have moved so 
apps, apps are now more appealing to apps are more appealing where dating has moved to apps mm. yeah yeah where the dating has moved to apps it's become more appealing to younger people yeah so people find it cool and they're no longer ashamed to say yeah i'm they're on this hinge, app they're on whatnot app. whereas before yeah it's if, like, if you're on a dating app you're you're yeah, looking at this funny yeah, like yeah, 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 yeah. so obviously that stigma is still there where people are like not everyone's comfortable to say yeah they're on hinge they're on puff they're on bumble whatever mm. but slowly but surely the mm. stigma is going away definitely so definitely because yeah. like even now yeah girls are very comfortable to tell you they're on hinge yeah yeah, yeah. do you yeah, know what i'm saying yeah. you like, find their profile and they're still and, they still and, come with it yeah they, they yeah, come yeah, with yeah. it do you know what i'm saying <laughs> but before it's like ah, yeah. oh, it's, it's a taboo to be found yeah, on yeah, pof yeah yeah, yeah now yeah. you find someone yeah. on hinge it's yeah. like yeah i'm there yeah, yeah. i'm yeah. trying to find love <laughs> do you know what i'm saying it's nuts the term no shame doesn't apply to them no 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 exactly there is no shame in this yeah there's no talk yeah so so yeah, that's one that, that's pro is. which is benefiting uh, match group. Match group, yeah. So, what would you say? What are your two pros? Um, for me personally, my main pro is the fact that with these dating sites, you mm. can literally meet anyone from any anywhere in the world mm. in in minutes. Whereas before, it's like you're you're, you're limited to Facebook, yeah, and Instagram, yeah, yeah, yeah. and yeah. it's like it's yeah. a bit more restricted. You yeah. can't be so direct. Yeah, yeah, this one, everyone's there. They know what they're on, yeah. and they're all over the world. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you, you, you can <laughs> even you can even restrict the area <laughs> to five mile radius. <laughs> your back garden. You're looking for babies in your. In, do you know what I mean? It's so true. yeah, it's it's, 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 a, it's very controlled. Yeah. Like you're in London and you're meeting someone in Manchester. Manchester. Do you know what I'm saying? Scotland. Or you can meet someone in your end. Yeah. You know what yeah. I'm saying? You you have the control. Even deep in Kumasi. <laughs> in the bushes <laughs> and, uh, so so yeah so the whole point is that you're not restricted anymore innit? yeah it gives you mm. a very broad range of uh, talent to yeah. pursue that's why certain men don't know how to move to girls because yeah. all they do yeah sit on their phones, on their phones there's no yeah. social skills yeah yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. it does None. Just open. But, uh, uh, anyway that, that's, that's, yeah, another that's, topic. that's yeah. another topic yeah. Yeah. yeah um the other thing is match became um match is more at it's more seen as a casual dating site mm. whereas um the competition like eHarmony are seen more as more as um Man a looking serious, to get married yeah that, that type looking of thing. to get married yeah, you know yeah, what i mean yeah. so so there's a restriction with the competition whereas mm. with the apps on the match group they're more approachable mm. you know what i'm saying they're easy and and another another pro that's not even here is the fact that coronavirus restricted people from leaving their houses mm. so you know you have to stay at home and move to people from your house. Yeah. Do you yeah, understand? Yeah. So for me, those are my three pros as to why the stock price is going to do well or mm. this industry is going to do well as a whole. Yeah. Yeah. So, so yeah. Should we go through a few uh, cons here? Yeah? yeah. Yeah. Why not? Yeah. So right now I feel like the competition for match group is not as strong as mm -hmm. it should be. Mm -hmm. I feel like, uh, match group is an industry that's going to continue to grow. Like you said, mm -hmm. everyone's stuck indoors. Yeah. I know they got competition like Bumble and um, eHarmony, e yeah. but another one that I would say I throw into the hat as well mm. is maybe Instagram, because mm -hmm. Instagram is pretty much a picture sharing um, yeah. app, app yeah. but people use it to move to girls as well. Yeah. And you know how Facebook, Mark, Mark Zuckerberg, he's always finding new ideas and yeah, yeah, doing yeah. stuff. They've got a dating section on Facebook. Swear down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. There They've you got go. got a dating section on Facebook. Because I was literally going to say, the way he always um, copies someone's idea yeah. and brings it into his own apps, he's probably going to do this with yeah, Instagram with Facebook, or Facebook, Instagram, isn't it? Yeah, but you're yeah, saying yeah. No, it's already, already there. They already have it. Yeah, yeah they so already have it. I think with um, with Match Group here, yeah, they need to be careful because yeah. if they don't stay on top of their game, someone might take them out, even yeah. though like... Oh, so I get your point. So you're basically trying to say that they're, they're, they're not very worried about their competition, so they're yeah. not being innovative. Whereas yeah, the competition yeah. is being innovative, like yeah, yeah. Facebook, for example. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. yeah, with with their competition, yeah, they shouldn't just look at eHarmony and Bumble. Yeah, they should look at other. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. The smoke yeah. come from yeah, anywhere. Exactly, because the yeah. industry is still growing. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. And uh, yeah, you can date off anything. Yeah, 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 yeah. It makes sense. All right, cool. Um, I mean another con is that there's always a new app on the market mm. with this kind of industry because it's always changing mm. basically very similar to your point um people get bored easily with yeah. these kind of apps you know what i mean everyone at some point is on pof now mm. everyone's on on hinge yeah what's next kind of thing signing their life away but basically yeah <laughs> so so it's like the 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 market changes very quickly. Mm. There's no loyalty in this game, innit? Yeah. People just go where all the babes are. Yeah. <laughs> all the girls yeah. decide yeah. to jump on this app today, yeah. all the band them are gonna mm. jump on that app. So yeah, there's 
is there's always a risk that it, the, the 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 market could move somewhere else. Yeah, it could yeah. shift to a different platform. Mm. So that's a potential con for um for match group. Yeah. Um. Now the the last one is the fact that um we well it's alleged mm. that match group were allowing bots mm. to finesse people to sign up. <laughs> Do you know what I'm the saying? People are very silly. Yeah. They, they close their eyes. So basically, the situation is, mm. um. When people sign up to these apps, sometimes you might get dodgy messages from mm. scammers saying to you, you know, I'm a sexy girl, come and check out my pictures. Mm. But obviously you have yeah. to sign up to go and look at these extra pictures, isn't it? Princess Zamunda kind of yeah. messages. <laughs> <laughs> Princess Zamunda. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So obviously th- th- there was a, th- they were sued for the fact that they allowed these scammers to prevail mm. because they had a be- they, they had an interest in that situation yeah. as well where people were more people were signing up to the app mm. to basically chat to these scammers who they didn't know were scammers yeah. or catfish yeah. if we want to call it that so um yeah that's 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 something that yeah. would go against just shows that match the group. possibility that they'll always be uh, plagued by scandals especially mm. with scammers and mm. all of these kind of stuff yeah 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 because yeah you can't you can't be out here promising love you can't, you, you can't. can't. Yeah. yeah, but I'm, I'm sure they. Try, I try, I'm sure they try to promise love. Because that's that's pretty much what they were yeah. doing. The scammers were basically sending out these messages, you yeah, mm. know, and it's basically forcing people to um, see what that app is about. So they will um, sign up to one of the subscriptions because they're thinking, right, this bot here looks like a painting. Yeah. <laughs> so let me. I've, I'll probably reach my limit of five. Yeah. So let, let me let sign me up. Pay for the extra. Yeah, so yeah, I can swipe on that yeah. one. You swipe, exactly. you sign up, you swipe, swipe. it turns out to be a, a, bo- yeah. a finesse thing. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Right. So, yeah, the growth strategy. Let's go through the growth strategy, yeah? Okay. So, um, I would say they've got two major growth, uh, growth strategies. Mm-hmm. One of them is to remove the stigma of online dating. Mm. Are they going to do that? Yeah. It's mad, <laughs> isn't it? <laughs> it's mad. Yeah. How can you do that? Yeah. Just as yourself. I know you that. Um, Explain what the stigma is, though, first, for people who don't know. Yeah, so like I said earlier, mm. um, the whole stigma is mm. the elder generation. Mm. <laughs> they're the ones that people see as the serial online daters. Yeah. They're the ones that are behind the laptops, yeah. uh, doing keyboard warrior, trying to finesse babes, etc., yeah. etc. Et mm. And with a Match Group, they're trying to take that away and say, nah, um, dating it, for anyone for everyone, kind of yeah, thing. Yeah, you know, yeah. Don't it's be ashamed. It's a safe space. It's a, sh- it's a safe space, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, you can. So mm-hmm. They're trying to remove that, but with a uh, match group hmm. they can't do that alone How the whole can, industry needs the to do whole that. industry has to do it all together yeah. you can't do that no mm-hmm. but why are they probably thinking they they could do that is because they own a lot of these big name yeah. companies they own the it? majority of them yeah well, you would think they own the majority of exactly the yeah but i don't think they could do that alone it's impossible it doesn't matter how much cash it, you can it, that's you the thing you have yeah. to pump a lot of money into into marketing yeah. to change yeah. the perception yeah. of people yeah 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 and there's millions of data like on these, exactly on these so exactly it's gonna be nuts and the second point here mm. would be they're trying to reduce bad dates. So you man that always get finessed because you didn't ask for a profile picture. Yeah. You just go and buy the words they just say, well, they're sweet, sweet nothings on the phone. <laughs> hey, and then you see your contract at the end of the month is a mad thing. Yeah. And you've gone to meet the babes and she's... It's nobody. Yeah. It's a brother. <laughs> <laughs> like... Oh, yeah, so what man. they're trying to do right now, yeah, is introduce uh, video technology, so mm. you get to see the person that like you're chatting. To. Yeah, but, no, but fam, I've got uncles in Ghana in that year. Yeah, that they'll 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 hire a girl yeah. to come and be chatting to you mm. as an Englishman here. Jesus. Yeah, they'll, they'll they'll hire the girl to sit in front of the camera yeah. and pretend to be the one that's been chatting to you. Mad. And obviously, when the girl goes home, they'll just continue chatting Mad. to you and then get you to send the, the peas in it. The thing will always so, happen. So, bro, that video that video chat thing, I don't think obviously it's, it's gonna it's gonna remove do a lot man, of riffraff. Do man them all girls here, not exchange numbers and ask for video calling like FaceTime or whatever. I would think that's common sense, but yeah. not everyone has that common it's sense. True. Common sense is yeah, not common. It's not at all. Yeah, yeah, it's you not understand? Common. People yeah. are still getting. It. So, so I guess this video tech idea mm. is good. Yeah, yeah, it's gonna help help the situation a lot but it's not going to save yeah. the situation it's like with instagram they mm. brought in video technology and the yeah. dms and stuff like that yeah. but who really uses I'm, that i don't th- i think i probably used it once probably used it never once used bro it. never used it you know what i'm saying yeah. so obviously we'll see what the adoption rate is going to be like yeah but for me personally i don't know mate yeah it's nuts um it's I'd, hard to change behavior yeah. Yeah. yeah especially it's adults very hard yeah. exactly yeah. so it's, it's a good growth strategy i'm yeah. happy that they have a growth strategy because not everyone has a growth yeah. strategy so we'll just see how it works out mm. yeah that's it so yeah the Let's ratings the ratings all right yeah. so you go first 
All right, so I'll say 3.5 out yeah. of 5. Okay, yeah. why so, is that? My reason is they got hella cash in the bank. Yeah. But they're not advertising. They're not using it for advertising. Mm. And even if they were, they can't be, be as innovative as they want it to be mm. simply because the competition in the market were their main competitors. Ignore what I said about Instagram for now. Their main mm. competitors, eHarmony and Bumble, you don't really know what they're doing because they're not doing much. <laughs> <laughs> They're not no, doing maybe, much at maybe, all. Maybe, maybe people just haven't researched into what they're doing. Nah, but with like eHarmony like, yeah, and Bum... Nah, nah, not me personally. No, 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 I'm not saying you. No, 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 no. Hey, this brother's tapped. Nah, 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 nah. Not you, but I'm saying people. Uh, hey, people, yeah, yeah. People, people, people. people, 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 people yeah, yeah, people. nah, nah. I, I don't do this. The, 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 the dating. Nah, 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 Okay, cool, cool, cool. Nah. But yeah, anyways, swiftly moving on. Moving on. Yeah. So, um... That's completely from your... F- <laughs> 3.5 out of 5. Yeah, 3.5 yeah. out of 5. Simply because they can't be as innovative as they want to be. Yeah. Because these other companies are not being as innovative mm. as they should be. So yeah. it's not pushing it's not um, push Match Group to think beyond what they innovate. should do. Yeah. 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 That makes sense because if your competition is tight, you will look for ways yeah, you're gonna to go drive. hard. Yeah, yeah, you're yeah. Gonna yeah. Go hard they, they don't have that pressure. They don't. They don't yeah. have that pressure. Okay, that makes sense. So, uh, yeah. How about you? Right, so for me... Um, the fact that you said right before you're saying this, it shows bro, that... Bro, <laughs> it's, it's, it's a sticky one because, yeah. again, there's pros and cons in my head. Okay. Right? So, I've put, I've given a four. Okay. And that's a four to buy, yeah? Mm. Four out of five, mm. that's me telling you to buy. Mm. And that's simply because of their financial position. Mm. Bro, they're a dating service, mm. yeah? And they have... They, they bring in two billion a year, bro. That's mm. ridiculous. Um, their profits, 500 million. Mm. Their free cash flow, 800 million. Mm. These are big astronomical numbers. Yeah, and they've yeah, been around still. for years. Tech is growing. Yep. The industry is growing. Mm. So I think personally, they're going to be around for a very long yep. time. Now, the issue, the con that is just big in my head right now is the um, market price. Okay. Why is the market price now so close to the highest 52 <laughs> range? It doesn't make sense. Yeah. So, so to me right now, that 147 is basically them at their peak. Mm. The only way is down. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I've However... Got, I've got something to add on mm, to your point after. Yeah. If, if you're going short term, yeah. Mm. To me, if you look at that 147 price tag on the stock right now, the only way is down. However, if you're looking long term... Everything should be long term anyway. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. As Mike said, everything mm. should be long term anyway. If you're looking long term, then um, as I said again, believe in tech. Tech is going up. Uh, they're, they're in a very strong position financially and they've been around for a while. And... To be honest, their their strategy of just buying out the competition, bangs. Yeah. It's working. So I think they'll be around for a very long time. So I think it's a buy. I'm giving it a four out of five. Yeah. To also to yeah. touch on what you said about their growth strategy, mm. the CEO that they've got now mm-hmm. has recently come in. That's mm. a new CEO. Mm-hmm. And the fact that um she's just come in here mm. and they they used to be owned by I think a parent company um called IAC. Okay. And they've split from them and just become their match group or whatnot yeah mm. the fact that she's taken over at such a critical time um and she's managed to um oversee this whole like period of change during the corona mm. is boosting investors um, confidence, confidence in the, okay, in the company okay. innit? so that's why it's peaking now yeah that's that's probably why it's peaking now mm. and also as well like like i said like Whenever someone new comes in, everyone's excited. Mm. You want to see what the person has yeah. to offer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, it's like when you have a new football manager. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The yeah. players play well for the first uh, exactly. two games. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see where it yeah. goes. Mm. So, so, so long term, how do you feel long term? I feel long term mm-hmm. and the business will grow. Mm-hmm. But I don't know whether that'll be five years, 10 years. I'm not too sure. Mm. But also depends on whether new competitors come into the market mm. or whether someone like Facebook... Facebook um, they introduce something and I feel like they're going to they're, they're capitalize. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. They're let's, looking for that next next new thing. Let's yeah. wait and see. Yeah. That's what I'll say as well. Yeah. Let's wait and see. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, cool. So I think that that's pretty much everything um, we have to say around around the match group stock. Mm. Anything else to add? No, nah, if you're dating right now, mm-hmm. make sure your social skills are on point because yeah. when it comes to meeting a person face to face, it's going to be peak. That's it. That's it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're not here to give dating advice though. <laughs> to that channel yeah yeah if, but if you do want to know about stock make sure you subscribe to this channel because yep. that's all we talk about and please like the video because it helps a lot yeah and subscribe please until next one thank you thank you